What's up, Rob here from Man Vs. Pin. Now, a lot of you have been suggesting this bacon candle, so I've taken it upon myself to head into the fucking jungle with a loaded weapon to kill some pigs, just for you guys. Shh, you gotta keep your voice down. What the f was that? in there. That wasn't the best idea. Now this process continued on for what seemed to be hours. So much bacon. And a ridiculous amount of delicious, incredibly tasty, and nutritious liquefied pig lard. The aftermath was kind of traumatic with a slippery as fuck fat covered floor. And everything else, really, just a glistening mess. But the payoff is I've got fucking bacon for days. Not to mention, uh, hopefully, enough bacon fat to make some candles. I grabbed some small mason like jars and a couple of wicks and hot glued them to the bottom, and then began pouring. Oh, yeah, there it is. Very reminiscent of the warm piss cup that you have to fill up at the doctor's. I threw them in the fridge for a few hours and then came back shortly after to discover some pretty awesome looking candles. Well, I'll be. Look at that. I trimmed the wicks, put down the lights, and there you have it. Blubbery, coagulated animal oil uh, made into a candle. I've had some pretty bad luck with candle making before, uh, as you may know, but this one, this one I'm really proud of. And now time-wise, these things, they burn uh, forever, really, I guess. Uh, this one was burning 20, 30 minutes before I put it out. I also read that boar oil is really good for your skin, so if you have any left over, uh, be sure not to waste it. But back to the candle, the best part is that it smells like bacon. This is the goddamn best candle ever made. That'll do, pig. That'll do.